Durst the worst. Durst the worst. Durst the worst. Oh, Durst the worst. Durst is the worst. Durst 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 the worst. I'm with uh, my own outlet. Give me my car here. If you want one. I was just curious because it's nice and shiny and oily if you like it. <laughs> I was just wondering because I think the most important part of this protest is see all these people? Yes, I've been talking to him a little bit. Oh, yeah. And trying to get the unedited Over interviews. All people that he kicked the hornets and we are angry that he's using this as an excuse to clamp down on people. That's why I got my sign here. This is Eva Stewart T. Dems are the real fascists. So the idea is that he controls everything, he controls us. No, he doesn't. He has to act within the limits of the Constitution. It doesn't matter how many edicts he writes and says, I have an executive order. We don't care. He's got a bought and paid for New World Globalist, whatever you want to call them, idiot that's giving him bad advice. We have the right to replace him. See all these angry people? We will pay you a Global visit, Mr. Will replace. We do not want to put up with it. Are you going to pay a visit at the mansion? I've heard some talks we about that. Might. I want to check that out for sure. I'm going to make sure I mean, I'm there for that. It's not like we have anything personally against him, but professionally, how many screw-ups do you have to do before you get fired? I don't know. some words, too. Whenever, uh, it seems like whenever the public sector screws up, we give them more money, unfortunately, so. Yeah. That's... Well, take a look at, uh, Schumer and Pelosi. Pelosi I'd rather not. <laughs> going through money like nobody. No. Yeah, they're kind of goofy, aren't they? Beep. Beep. I was Look. hoping for a show of force. I mean, it's a shame that the younger generation is so brainwashed. What do you expect from a totalitarian government education system? We can do no wrong. Oh, well, really? Tell me again. Thank you. Oh, you're clearly just selfish Karens who just want to get your hair cut. I see it now. What do, what do you think about that? What do you think about that whole meme? You know, you're, you, that you're just a bunch of privileged white Karens and Kyles who just want to get your hair cut and there's no other concern or need uh, at play. You heard, have you heard that All before? Right. Have you heard that? First of all. Because I've heard that a million times so far. Our country is one of the best on earth. Why? For this reason. You're allowed by law to do this. Despite what the governor may want to say, we have a better functional system in place than Venezuela, which is their idea though. of exactly what they want. You right. like it so but much? Evers, why don't you go to China? Stay there. Right. Why don't you go to Venezuela? China, Stay yeah. there. I mean, their system okay. of government is totalitarian, How you doing? socialist. Good. What's the sign want? say? Personal health is a personal responsibility. One, one common retort I'm seeing to that is like, oh, asymptomatic spread, you know, like uh, you go out, you're going to get a bunch of people sick and they're all going to die. Mm. What, do you, what would you respond to that? If you go out, then you're accepting the responsibility that you might get sick. Right, right. So obviously if you infect someone, you're only going to infect someone who's already consented. And if, you are li and if you're liable to be infected, then you should be staying home. Consented? So what do you mean by that? Because if you go out, then you're accepting the responsibility that you might get sick. Okay, okay. You get it? I, I get it, I get it for sure. I'm just playing devil's advocate a little bit. Uh, what, what's, the, what's the other side say? Well, Is that a dong? <laughs> no, it's not. And I, stopped I was wondering what that was. I stopped trying it because it was supposed to be a mask. Oh, okay. It was supposed to be a mask. But it looks like an upside down wang, kind of. I don't see how it looks like one. It was supposed to be a mask. I, I, I more or less agree with you guys. By the way, I'm just sort of like, you know devil's advocate. I, I do very much want this whole thing to end and I do think that it's been an overreaction but... Well, if, the, you're, if you're really that sick that you have to stay home then you stay home. Right, right. And if you know, if you're not liable then you can go out you know, but I mean it's like obviously if you're choosing to go out then you're also accepting the risk that you can get sick. Right, so right. So if only the people who are okay with getting sick go out, then you're not going to be infecting anyone that you shouldn't be affected. Yeah, I guess, but that's yeah. regardless, whether there's coronavirus or not. 
Yeah, the infection rates were low such that I think we really didn't need to shut the entire system but down. Not only that, it's like... Especially not here. You know, people who are vulnerable, you know, if they get, like, just the cold, you know, they're going to be done. Right on. If you have AIDS, you know, you don't have a good immune system. So if you have AIDS and you get anything, you know, then it's deadly for you. Right, right. So, coronavirus or not, it's just, that's, it's no different than anything else that you have right now. Why do you think people are having such a difficult time, sort of, you know... What? People are having a difficult time recognizing that a lot of the problems associated with this are not, like, the disease itself. It's the reaction to it. How do, how do we get through to them? You know, the people that are losing their jobs, people are, you know, not making enough money... Uh, Milwaukee Public Schools just passed a referendum that people aren't going to be able to, like, make money to pay for because they're out of work. You know, I'm sure he, he you know, like, so there, there, so there's all these problems that are going to be long term because of this, too, that people haven't really thought about, you know, so how do we, how do we get through to them would be my question. Like, how do we convince them that we all need to go out again? I, you know, like, if not now, very soon, like. Well, obviously, we all need civilization to survive. I mean, right. even something as simple as going to the store, like how many people do you think get in the store once a week? The truck drivers who bring the food, the growers who grow the food, the workers who, you know, work at the store. So it's like just any one part of, you know, the economy depends on every other part of the economy. And right. That, and it's not just, you know, stuff that has to do with food. There's legal stuff, there's insurance. So the essential and non-essential differentiation is it's a little, it's a little silly, yeah. Civiliz Once civilization collapses, we die. Yeah. Because we all need civilization to survive. If you were asking how do the people understand... How do we get through to them? To, yeah. I will quote Rahm Emanuel. He was the mayor of Chicago. He yeah. screwed it so bad yeah. he had to have a runoff election that he quit. But here's what he said. Never let a good crisis go to waste. Of course. Really? That too because what does that mean? Oh, and Hillary, she said it too. Oh, like it's been said before, never let a good... Where do these people get this? What crisis? What going to waste? Oh, I rewrote what he said into government isn't here to solve your problems. Just manage crisis we can manage you with. That's what he wants. That's what he wants. So, dude, how you doing? How you doing, man? Doing good. Yeah, give me my card if you want. Garbage human. It's a Charizard foil card of my face. Yeah. No! <laughs> I mean, as far as not letting a good crisis go to waste, it's like... Do you want one? They've been, they do that for everything. No matter if it's... Not even just coronavirus, but every time like, there's a mass... Like, it doesn't even have to be a mass shooting. Like, two people can die, and they make, like, oh, there was a mass shooting, and then they use that for gun control. Oh yeah, they're gonna so, use like, this. Every time that something happens, they spin it in such a way that they say that this is has to be the basis for a new agenda. They're gonna use this the way they used uh, 9/11 and Columbine to crack down on people's rights. And the deeps are on the rise. Germs are gonna be everyone's. Never yeah. let the prices go to waste. That's exactly it. Germs, I mean, when man. When the deeps are I think this guy is waiting to go. Oh, go ahead. Oh. Are you waiting to go? Through? I dropped something or other though. Did you want the video bombers? But no, it's cool. You have a cool hat, cool perspective, cool sign. Thank you. Yeah. Except for, except for the other side. It was supposed to be a mask. That's a very good thing. Not something bad. You know, if you are not. I have a moto, so I have a moto, by the way. A moto? I have a moto G7. Oh, right on. I'm pointing out because, like, nobody I know has motos. So whenever I see someone with a moto, I'm like, I have a moto too. Dude, it's like we're genetically connected or something. What do you have the power version? The what? Is, he, is yours the Moto Power? Oh, I have fucking... It just says Motorola, and it says, uh... Not much else. Yeah, I don't know. It's cool, though. I can uh, go out to these events sparingly these days, and, uh... You know, especially when corporate media is here with their bullshit, you know they're gonna... In my opinion, they're going to chop it up deceptively, and, uh... They're gonna what? Chop it up deceptively, and... Or, or in, an incomplete version of what the people were saying... We so. did that when they were at the protest, too, because I was at the protest in, um, on April 24th, and, like, I was... Here? To, no, in uh, er, Oh, right on. And they Oh, were, they did the Confederate flag uh, yeah, thing, like right? Yeah, they were Confederate flags, like, there were no Confederate flags, and I know because I walked around the whole thing multiple times, and I right. the whole building, and also saying, like, they were all armed, and it's like, five people had guns. 
you know? Right, which is the right. And, like, there were two whole Antifa people there, too. That's so a that's a big thing that I film for my channel, too. Yeah, it's like... Yeah, those, those guys are panty waves. The thing that happened, that, like, just a couple people did, and they make it like it was everybody. They are commie panty waves, Antifa. I just wanted to say that. And there were definitely thousands of people there, and they said it was, like, only a thousand. Right, yeah. so... So it's good that Kristan's here and that I'm here, and we're going to get uncut, you know, versions of all these talks. Put it on YouTube and then download it again after it's on YouTube so you can put it up again under a different username. It'll go up on, it's going to go up on Facebook and Library and BitChute and all that fun stuff. How you doing? What? How you doing? Yeah, maybe cut out this part of the sign. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's going to be the thumbnail. It was supposed to be a mask because there was another girl I saw who did a mask crossed out and saying my body my choice basically saying I don't want to be forced to wear a mask yeah you know? but why is nobody bringing up that it is our responsibility to keep our immune system get, take vitamin C vitamin D vitamin A zinc we can proactively help our immune system if we hide in a bubble we will have no immune system because our body will not be able to form an immune system you right. have to have germs and bacteria with which to interact or you will not have an immune system at all and anything will kill you. I mean, this is nuts. And plus right, there's the right. fact that, you know, caring for individual health is not even a responsibility of government. The government is there to take away evil people from society. Thank you. you right know? on, yeah. So, right. you know, the government is not supposed to be there to, to your be your parents, basically. To remove the, the uh, antisocial element from society. You know, I like that. And not antisocial, the evil people. Right, I mean, yeah. I... I'm kind of using it as a synonym a little bit. How is, like someone who's doing displaying antisocial, like, you know, like extreme. You're not there to tell me what do you mean that, that social extreme, extreme though? What do you like mean like that? sociopathy, you know, like Dahmer type shit. You, you mean know? like people who are violent? Yeah, like sociopaths they, and shit. Well, yeah. I mean, like not all sociopaths are violent, but... They're scared. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, basically they're there to remove people from society who are causing harm. Yeah, you know? I agree. And Ouch! I'm trying, bitch!